So we've just picked up the MetaQuest 3 and we're gonna run through the quick start guide, opening it up for the first time. When you open up the box, you will see that there is a QR code. I'm gonna scan that and we're gonna see how to set this up for a first time user. So it's asking me to download the Meta Horizon app. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Get download, all right. So that is downloading, super exciting because I've never had a VR headset before. So let's open up the app, log in or create a meta account. Oh wow, cool. We're gonna continue with our email. So I'm just filling out my details, email and name, and my birthday, which is February 6th. We'll keep the year between you and me. Setting up my password. All right. So I just agreed to the terms and I should be receiving a confirmation code to my email just now and there it is so we're gonna fill that in and we're on the way to creating our meta horizon account create a unique name for yourself i hope my name's not taken all right my name is not taken perfect so it's asking me to set my avatar i'm gonna start from a selfie create from a selfie here we go so it's making my avatar from my selfie let's see how it looks okay so I'm just setting up my avatar here. I'm gonna maybe edit that guy later on. It's pretty cool because you can customize your avatar completely, but it looks like now we're just going to pick a nice fresh free fit and move forward. All right, basic essentials, we in business. So it asks if you wanna make a public profile or a private profile. For now, I'm actually gonna press a private profile and I'm gonna continue. Are you setting up a headset? Yes, I am setting up headsets. We're gonna set up headset, turn my Bluetooth on, and I'm gonna set up a MetaQuest 3. So next it asks, choose how you wanna connect your headset to Wi-Fi. So here I'm going to actually select QR code from this app. It's gonna ask you to enter your Wi-Fi details into the app. All right, now I got my QR code. So now it says, leave this screen open and put your headset on to continue setup. When prompted, hold this QR code up. All right, so it's time to put this bad boy on. Just so you know, no sunlight on lenses and no liquid cleaners. So we're actually going to take these stickers off and we're gonna put our headset on. This is exciting. This is the first time I'm putting this headset on my head. You might wanna turn it on first. There is a button down here at the bottom. I'm assuming it's gonna turn it on. Oh, there's a button on the side too. All right, so I just powered it on and we're gonna put this headset on here. All right, I'm gonna tighten this up and we're in motion. So it says to hold this QR code up, set your headset on. All right, this is cool. So it wants me to take my controllers and pull out these tabs. One controller live and two controllers live. And here we go. I'll we'll set this up. Adjust the lens depth. So you can adjust the lens depth by pushing the buttons inside here to pull it in closer or further away, depending on if you wear glasses. Right now I'm good, I'm not wearing my glasses. Adjust the head strap so comfortable and secure. Tilt the headset forward or back until you can see clearly and comfortably. Yeah, I'm seeing pretty, pretty good. I'm in. Adjust the clarity. Turn the wheel at the bottom of your headset to move the lenses until the text is clear and comfortable to read. So there's a knob on the bottom that you're going to adjust your PD distance. 34 plus 35, so my PD distance should be around 71. All right, looking good here now. Continue and use QR code from the Horizon app. So download the app and here is the code. So our code is scanned and we are connecting to the Wi-Fi. Wow, this is so crazy right now. Like I said, I've never used a VR headset before, so I am in a whole new world right now. Continue setup on Horizon app. Plug in your headset, your headset will play a sound when the update is complete. Use a mobile app to complete the next step. So let's take this off and we're back on the mobile app. Just getting everything all set up here. It's updating to the latest software. We're updating and then I guess we can continue after that. So once the headset updates, I'm gonna pair it. This is crazy. 
All right, so the headset just updated and we paired it to the phone and everything is looking good to go at the moment. So we successfully updated the device and paired it to the phone. It's asking me if I want to add any credit card details or go ahead and install the items that came with my MetaQuest 3, which is Batman Arkham Shadow and the MetaQuest Plus three month trial. I'm gonna do that later. So I'm gonna press not now and we are all set. So it's time to put this on and start exploring. So if you found this video helpful, please hit the subscribe button, turn on post notifications and look out for more videos we make on the MetaQuest 3. Anything that I find out that can help you, I'm definitely gonna share it on this channel. It was a pleasure and I'll see you in the next video.